If you've traveled Route 34 in Mount Holly Springs, you may have seen it. The Charlie Brown tree. The small town tree has become a big part of the community. But the tree you're looking at isn't the original. This is the fifth or sixth Charlie Brown tree that has been planted here. The original was just a straggler. It really looked like the Charlie Brown tree. This is a book that I have a lot of pictures in. That's me. <laughs> and no one knows the history of the tree. That's a little Charlie Brown tree. That was a earlier one. Better than 83-year-old Romaine Nicomans. Oh my, he's come a long way. She's been decorating the tree for 20 years. As the story goes, the original Charlie Brown tree was a wild tree. On Christmas Eve, sometime in the late 90s, a man and his wife bought garland and put it on the tree. Romaine says another woman started decorating the tree for a short time after that. And when she asked for someone to take over, Romaine volunteered. But the original Charlie Brown tree was cut down. It was four boys. So a new tree was planted. We decorated another one. It lasted for a little while. Then there were some accidents. We've had uh, cars hit a truck said, them. Oh, this is the one. And the stick incident. As far as I know, some lady had it. She didn't like it, and she hit it with a stick and broke some of the pieces off. We had another tree put in then. We just kept decorating them, whether they liked them or not. <laughs> we put the potato chip bags on them. Soon Romaine was decorating the tree year-round. It's a Halloween tree. It's an Easter tree. It was a hero tree. And the little Charlie Brown tree became one of those landmarks you look for as you pass through town. Some of them stops, looks at it. They take pictures of it. Sometimes people would stop and just watch us decorate it. They wanted to know who did it. But there'll be a day come that I won't can do it. Then I'll ask for my helper. <laughs> And for the past 10 years, that helper. That's why we do it. Has been David Toner. It's a sense of pride and accomplishment. Because this tree has inspired smiles. And happiness every time they pass it. Become a part of family traditions. Every year they bring their kids as small children and they make them come even after they're in college and they take the picture every year. And like a Charlie Brown tree is supposed to do, it inspires. Anyone that would see this would give them joy, encouragement to continue on. It's something that everyone enjoys. For a long time, they never knew who did it, or they do now.